Hey y'all, this old Lon Larry coming to you with my first devotion. Hope you enjoy it. Do not conform to the patterns of this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Then you will be able to rest and approve what God's will is. Can you remember the first time you donned a pair of polarized glasses? If you're like me, you took them off and put them back on several times because you couldn't believe the difference they made in what you saw. Cutting down on glare gives objects clarity and makes color more vivid. A Christians, what, as, as Christians, what we believe or the internal lenses of our mind impacts how we live and who we become. For example, if you view God as personal and involved in your life daily, you'll experience more joy. If you see, pe if you see people as God sees them, you'll become gentler toward them. If you believe that everything you are and own belongs to God, you will more naturally offer your time and resources to help others. Jesus desired to give us new internal lenses by transforming our minds. He does this as we firmly establish ourselves in what we believe. You have begun a journey of renewing your mind. As you meditate on what you believe, you will adopt a worldview that profoundly reduces glare and reveals clarity about how you should act to become more like Jesus. Soon others will notice the vivid difference, and hopefully you will too. Learning to think like Jesus, that's what we need to try and do. This is coming from a book called Believe and uh, that's what we believe, what I believe and who I am becoming. I'll leave you with these thoughts today. May the good Lord bless. And I love you. Talk to you later.